Hello there and welcome back to another episode. So in this one we've got quite some uh, quite some lovely plans. We um, started building up this mountain in the last episode with uh, the construction plans from Mechatron himself. Uh, I've kind of gone around and this is what we are going to do, at least for the time being. So we got those beautiful pillar mountain tops or ranges over here. And then uh, very sadly, we don't have like a temple. We just have some... Wait, do we still have shrines? We have medical bed over here. Oh, we don't have shrines either. Or am I very blind? Well, it seems like we don't have the shrines either. So what we are going to do here instead is a wind tunnel. Mika's wind tunnel right on top of this mountain. Then, um, yeah, we're going to have this single... What is it? Suspension bridge 5x1. Nice, lovely, long one over here. That is going to cross over. Oh, we're missing some roads. Actually, we should probably start building, building you as well. And um, yeah, that's how it's going to be. Then... The connection from this section that puts the water in the little lake in here is going to remain from that side. I don't think we have to move it to the top of this mountain over here. So yeah, let's get started with the build over here. We should have enough... What is it? Let's see. Enough uh, dirt right now. I am starting to rearrange things a little bit as well. So this one over here is going to be dirt. I do... I've noticed that once we... Get a bit of extract over here everything uh, sort of resumes but the storages are filling up rather quickly so so yeah i'm gonna have to make some changes over here we have okay this one's empty lovely you can oh dear they are gonna be stuck in there very soon so yeah i'm gonna have to move some things around okay so where were we you're gonna go top of here bit of a road and oh yeah we're gonna have to disconnect you for a little bit as well there's a couple of you i don't think we're gonna go any higher than this highest of priorities for you and now we should have a good connection again right so whilst they are giving us a bit more uh, sort of storage over here i've planned in our next construction project over here as well so um to make the extract that we have and we are producing in the centrifuge over here we seem to be lacking a bit of uh, bad water logs we have and where are you guys you guys are running around as well probably having to haul all that bad water over i mean we might have to even create some more jumps for the haulers themselves but right now i think yeah uh, extracting or pumping out bad water is probably our priority there's only like five or six in the whole colony that means both of our districts together oh i see okay there's not a lot in here another thing that we could probably do oh yeah we're gonna have to make this a little bit better so dynamite's in here I mean, we could probably... Hmm, that's going to be a little bit more difficult and annoying. We can deepen this section here first. Oh, there's one more over there. Here you go. So yeah, deepen this area over here first. Once this is at the length that we want or at the depth that we want, then we can relocate some of those water pumps or the uh, bad, bad water pumps and then remove everything from here and deepen this section as well. I guess that's what we are going to have to do. All right, quite a few notifications. Let's sort you guys out as well. This one, dirt, and so is the last one. All right, very lovely. We can stack three of you here. And then all we are going to need is a few stairs. Okay, highest priority for the bottom one, just to make sure that we still have the access going through this whole area. I have also noticed that we could make this a little bit more efficient efficient isn't it okay here we go the drought is finally over rainy season starts and uh okay so they are still uh you might not have the access to you now they've done a couple of things already so that's lovely and uh, the reason why we can be quite relaxed over here is because we only have uh, bots that are constructing. So yeah, no worries. Not gonna have any contaminated beavers, hopefully. Okay, another warning over here. Beavers injured materials. 
Someone needs water. Oh yeah, okay, so you are a little bit empty. There's two of you actually. I'm thinking we might have to build a couple more of those water dumps in here just in case. Maybe block off this area a little bit better as well. Just the river section, I mean. Hmm, okay, we'll, we'll see. I think we're fine for the time being. So let's take a quick look at this mountain here as well. Oh dear, they've already done the bridge. So that uh, is linking up the mountain. That is going to be the only way to enter this area. And um, I mean, right now we're going to... Or are we? Yeah, this is going to be a little bit... Or maybe it's not shorter. I, th I was going to say it's a little bit shorter. But the, where the dirt is coming from... So the dirt is coming from there. And then the beavers are... Well, they can go up from here. And then this way. And then from here. Yeah, those stairs were supposed to be temporary. But for the time being, let's just place them here. Because I have a feeling some of those beavers might choose to... Traverse and travel through that zone instead. I guess we'll see. Or maybe not. Maybe I was just hoping too much. The, um, the, yeah, the links, I think, they are pretty much done, aren't they? We are, oh, I see. So we've got some problems building up this zone in here. All we're going to have to do is, let's, um, do we, we have the side platform, but they're not able to build anything from there. I think that should be an easy solution as well. Let's just build a couple of ladders over here. And there we go. Just another storage left and we should be pretty much loaded for the future. I, I don't think we're going to need any more dirt stored up than this. Even if we are going to have some bigger projects. Yeah, and that means we can pause definitely one of them. Right. Okay. Are we bumping out some bad water? Yes, we are. These beavers are starting to run in as well, so that is fantastic. Okay, so that means, I mean, the distance from here is 111. That is fine. We can do... Is this the right height? It does look like so. And then... I don't suppose we really desperately need them. But I'm going to do them anyways. Now, we've had a couple of trouts already. And I don't want to make this too complicated, so let's just see when the bandite starts, drop it down. And when it ends, actually, do we need to... Yeah, yeah, let's drop it down when it ends, and let's just do 1.5. And this one's going to be the same when the bandite starts, go to zero, and when it ends, 1.5. Okay, just want to ensure that we keep a little bit of water or bad water in this zone. You might say it doesn't matter too much since we... We have the bad water discharge built over here already. But yeah, just in case, let's just, you know, have like this lovely little tank. It kind of fits the area as well. Then uh, let me just speed up the time a little bit. Okay, now it's light again. We can see the next thing I'd like to do in here. I have raised a little bit of those, those sides already. And what we can do now, hopefully we're going to get some, some beavers that are free. I would like to change up this zone a little bit. Okay, these ones are going to go here. And let's just grab a couple of floodgates and place them just like so. Uh, right now, I don't think anything's going to be in our way. And we should be able to construct all of you guys, right? All right, let's do some of those dams on top of you. These ones can go and floodgates will go over there. Yeah, we just had the, the rainy season start, so we should be all right. And the reason why we're doing this, I was thinking I like to sort of raise this area up a little bit. It doesn't seem that we need this many or this much coffee in this area. So I'd like to kind of flip the, the plantation over here. I like to everywhere where you see coffee is where I like to place down mangroves instead. And then um, I, I guess in here, this is where we can do the coffee plantation somehow. So in order for this to work, we're going to have to raise this whole area up a little bit. And as soon as they finish the construction over here, we should be good to go. But we're just going to leave them on a slightly lower priority. Oh yeah, we should probably put you on a slightly lower priority. There we go. Okay, you guys as well. And this is also, that's probably even lower of a priority than the other one so there we go our main priority is still building up this area here 
it is probably gonna be a little bit slower because there yeah there's only so much they can do at a time now when it comes to access we should probably create some alternative and better ways to get up here as well okay so you guys can go from here let's pause you for the time being we'll bring it back in a little bit once everything is done okay so we can get the ladders done and yeah that's gonna be a little bit difficult as well let's just delete you for the time being now how are we gonna climb up there i guess there's only one way isn't it okay there we go ladders all the way to the top and knowing that the beavers are a little bit useless at times we are gonna place a few double platforms just to support them a little bit as well all right probably gonna have to do the same on this side here we go all the way to the top and a couple of platforms and there we go what about this side can we i hope we can do them both at the same time i i think we do there we go few ladders over here should be able to cross all over this place let's place one over there and then maybe a couple more over here okay then the next one hmm i guess they could also just cross over from here right yep that should be fine and then the rest of it, hmm, if we pause you for a little bit, then um, it should be A-OK. -okay. Lovely, let's leave the beavers to their jumps for a little bit. Let's zoom around the place as well. So one day, once we get some more beavers and bots, I would also like to start uh, replanting trees into this little little junction that we have. That's uh, irrigating this little canal and the and the lake at the end for our future farming district. But right now we just don't seem to have the the number of bots that we that we need. Metal is still fine, which is very surprising. I mean, we only have two of these stations in here. And they're not even bots running it 24-7. It's just the normal beavers, which is very surprising, I must say. I would like to, yeah, get some more bots. So pretty certain we can do one more. But I'm thinking we might have some more metal smelters here. We do one, two, and a third one, which is pretty perfect. Pass the power straight to the top from here, and yeah, this road isn't very necessary. So they can always go through, well, I guess it is a little bit more direct. Hmm, yeah, probably gonna have to improve or change this in the future now, aren't we? Yeah, I guess it could make it a little bit more direct. Alright, here you go. This way they can climb over, and that means we can change you up as well let's empty you oh wow okay we're lucky you are already empty indeed clean you up let's go here and this gap can be can be closed up as well what are we doing right now okay so you're not very don't have a lot of dirt left which means this corner can be filled with the with the logs and with the rest of you we can probably do at another time as well but um let's figure out where can we place you if this is gonna be like roads okay for storage i guess we don't need another one because this should be enough storage for the for the dirt okay then um yeah those assembly assembly lines would be lovely if we get them over here this also means we do want to place some more storage over here Let's see, can you fit? No, you cannot, because that's... Oh yeah, that's a little bit annoying. Could place a couple over here. No, we can't do a couple. Okay, so fine, we can do you this way. A few of you stacked up. And we'll probably have to change up this area a little bit as well, which uh, shouldn't be too big of a problem. So grab a tile, we'll give you the highest of priorities. Here you go, speed up the time a little bit. And then we'll place the road just like so. Pull it through. And... Okay. Tidy up. Large warehouse can go over here. And then we can do a stack of... Stack of small ones just like so. Actually, never mind. We are going to need the... The ladder... Right about there. Hold on a second. Alright. There we go. Stranded. Three of you. Of course... Uh, right. How are we gonna get you guys out from there? Ah, 
Okay, a couple more over here. Roads and a priority because you guys are a little bit silly. Right. Did we place them the right way around? I think we did. And yeah, that, that should be built pretty or fairly quickly. Then um, don't worry, we'll rescue you in no time. Now, you guys are complaining, that's fine, just go and get one of those chargers, another two, and oh, wow, okay. Where's the fifth one? Okay, a couple of you are in the same tile, it seems. We should be able to push them out as soon as they start doing the tiles over here. Okay, and you guys are going to be fine because we have ladders. You lot are not okay, because... Hmm, it's not the same height. Is anyone doing? Let's give you a higher priority. And this one a higher priority. And hopefully we can do the same for the last one. Or actually, it might be quicker if we just do a platform like so with the highest of priorities. Okay, now a few of those beavers have escaped or have they not? No, they have not. We're not too far though, just need a couple more planks which I think are being delivered. Here we go, build this up and... Voila. Come on, get out of here now. Okay. This leaves us with the two unfortunate ones, but I think you guys are fine now as well. Right, so whilst the beavers are getting the rest of the mountain done, which isn't too far off now, it seems. Okay, a couple of you guys are over here as well. Please make sure you are not going to get stuck. I mean, they probably are, but oh well. Well, um, I guess we'll have to rescue them later. But um, yeah, so whilst they are constructing and completing the mountain, there is another thing. Actually, hold on a second. I think I've noticed here. They're not going to be able to move to this side. Oh, never mind. We have already paused the, uh, this terrain block over here. I was just worried that they might not be able to complete the, uh, the last three over here, but it seems we're fine. Right, so whilst the beavers are building up the, the mountain, our final part for the, the well-being, which one was it? The wind tunnel... Mika's tunnel over here is gonna require some power. I have left a bit of a cap in the mountain here already and uh, we've got the power shafts in place but we still have to connect it up with the rest of the colony so for that we are gonna put those power wires right above their heads not under or in the ground. Yeah I, I used to prefer hiding them underground but nowadays I feel like I think it's a little bit more immersive and a bit more cool when you can sort of see everything that's happening in the colony. Okay, to connect them up, I found a, a little link in here that we can remove. But to do that, we're going to have to build up a couple of these platforms over here, a few stairs as well, and then we can sort of go and uh, steal a bit of power from that side. Everything else, since it is on the second tile should be fine to construct yeah they should have the range okay no good selected um right over here we wanted to i think it is the pot parts that we want to do in here isn't it yep so first one was the chassis we're going to do pot heads and the top one you are going to take the limbs okay lovely then uh, we've got a bit of space in here and as we said I think it's going to be somewhere, let's have a look, one, two, pause them for now since we don't need them. I don't think we want to do platforms in here, so let's place a couple of more tiles. You're going to go here and then the power shall pass through here. Yep, I think that is fairly sensible, isn't it? Okay, you can, you cannot. Oh, that's, uh, that's going to be a little bit more interesting, isn't it? So let's say we climb up from here and the rest is going to be tiles again and then roads. Okay, yeah, that can work as well. Place you down over there and then bring the power up, connect you. So that leaves us quite a bit of space in here. What do we want to do with this space? I do want to build a few more assemblers. But it is also a lovely area to have a few more factories. Let's see, we've got the bots in the science, assemblers, you would... Oh, never mind. No, we are lacking a bit of space in here. We could place you this way as well. We can do a couple at least. 
that means we, again we're not gonna have the space for the factories well that's very unfortunate then again let's say we are gonna place you for example over here we can do another one in front of you okay that could work and then if we really want to we could have one of these factories over there and then potentially one over here as well now here's is something we are fairly low and in the future i think this area is still probably going to change a little bit how about building you over here like so it might be a little bit better option isn't it i think so it looks a little bit a little bit nicer and then we can do a few more tiles in here as well okay i think it is going to be time to disconnect you guys now i know it is pretty pretty sad but we are gonna need that space in here then uh, these factories are unfortunately a little bit further away unless we turn you around and face you this way no never mind let it just it's fine yeah they, they can just run it's not like it's too far we, we can maybe yeah change this one into scrap metal instead so unboss these factories you can start building all of them as well and the only reason we're building them here is just to pass the power through okay we're gonna do a universal one bring it up a tile make it two and then at the top okay come on here we go just get these ones done first and once we got the link in then we can build the rest of them as well and i think we'll be fine then so with one assembler right now we've got 65 beavers by building the second one here, we should be able to increase that to, to double, which is 130. So another 65 pots. That's going to be quite a lot to have in here, but uh, I feel we're going to have to send and ship some of them over. Oh dear. Oh right, of course, we've uh, they already managed to start blocking in a bit more. Oh yeah, they have. Lovely. I mean, not so lovely, but it's fine. I guess the coffee market is going to crash and the prices will go up yet again but that's okay we'll um we'll fix this up very soon okay another thing that i have just remembered but uh let's just detonate all this in here as well all right these ones off you go and now we should be able to delete you is the water flowing through oh here we go it's been something we wanted to complete quite some time ago. And now we can say it is fully automated without needing any mods. I mean, we're gonna have mods using these gates in here or controlling these gates, but the rest of it, yeah, at least we don't need those water dumps anymore. Hopefully we can fill it up to the brim, but yeah, we'll just give you a little bit of time to, to sort of allow more water to flow in there. Okay, quick check on the mountain over here. And... We are almost done, although... Oh, I see what the problem is. Now, that is annoying. We had it all built, but because they're facing that way... Oh, hold on a second. If we unpause you, they should be able to climb to the top over here and then still construct everything below as well. Highest of priorities. Please, let's get this done as well. We're not too far off. Uh, you we don't need anymore, do we? No, we can start deleting everything in here. Okay, take him out. And then uh, once we get the last side done over there, we can place down the wind tunnel and the mountain will be complete. And here we go. The last piece is finally done, which means we can get rid of all the annoying little ladders over here. Let's clean up the space. Highest priority, please, to get them all done. Now the next step, let's grab the wind tunnel. Uh, facing this way okay i think that's gonna look pretty cool isn't it because we've got like this little lake or a pond that's inside the mountain under the wind tunnel and uh would be even cooler if we were to like extend it maybe like all the way here and turn it into a bit of a waterfall that drops into into this river system hmm definitely something to consider yeah, extend it a little bit, but getting the water, I guess we could have pots dumping off that water, although it's a little bit annoying, so maybe having like little canal or a stream running here, where we get the mechanical pump that dumps all the, 
the, the, the water into this uh, this little pond in here. Well, anyways, something to consider for the future. Definitely have to note it down. Uh, what is this one over here? Okay, Crease is still coming in slowly. I have built another one here. Okay, a little bit short on the beaver power, it seems. So yeah, once we get some more bots in the colony... Right, so this section is done. Power's flowing through. Should be getting bots very, very soon. We got, okay, a couple of extra ones already. 65, I think, was the maximum that we were able to do before. And do they care? Let's give you a high priority as well. I would like to get this done right away. Then you seem to be preferring this entrance over here. Now you've changed your mind. You're going... Oh... Okay, that is very interesting. You can just sort of stick your nose through the mountain. Or maybe there's a bit of a gap where they're passing through the resources. I don't know. It's really weird, but um, sure. All right, here we go. The building is finally done. We've got Mika's Mountain, the wind tunnel that's tucked away within the, within the mountain system that we have. And um, okay, well, since it's morning, we're not going to get any beavers to join the fun in here. So uh, let's just reduce the work hours. We'll let uh, everyone go and take a bit of a break. Okay, and hopefully we should see some visitors. Oh, yes, here we go. Just going to have to pause this for a second. Well, you look at that. That is looking pretty cool indeed. They've got like little backpacks on there. Oh, that must be from the uh, from hauling things around. So that's pretty cool. We've got another another entertainment over here. I do want to see how much, uh, how many points do they get for this as well? Wind tunnel plus three. Okay, so that's pretty good. And then uh, motivatorium plus five. Oh, maybe that's the one we should have done over here. Well, that's definitely going to be the next one we should do and build somewhere. But at least we're getting their their fun and well-being up and high now so yeah that's gonna be it for this episode so thank you so much for watching hope you enjoyed and i'll see you in the next one